Whipple had a ceremonial listening breakfast earlier today in the boardroom here at the exchange. Uh, gifts were exchanged between Mr. Grasso and Mr. Premji to symbolize a new partnership being forged as Wipro joins the family of NYSE listed companies. The company was awarded a bull and bear statue, symbolic of the forces that moved the markets. The official certificate of listing bearing the company's name and shares available to trade in today's date also were presented to Wipro. The New York Stock Exchange and Mr. Grasso were honored with a special painting from Chairman Premji. Their ceremony included remarks from Chairman Grasso, Chairman Premji, Spear, Leeds, and Kellogg specialist Mr. Andrew Cater, representing the specialist firm selected by Wipro to facilitate trading in the company shares. Now let's go down to the trading floor where our commentator Beth Gann is anxiously awaiting the crowning moment of today, the opening of trading for Wipro Limited's American Depository Shares. Thanks, Ralph. We're live on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange where approximately 3,000 companies trade shares every day. Spear, Leeds, and Kellogg is the specialist firm which will be handling the debut of Wipro stock here at Post 7. Joining me now is Stephen Delasio, Managing Director of Spear, Leeds, and Kellogg, who's going to give us an overview of what's going on here today. Can you explain what's going to be happening in the next few minutes? Sure. Right now we're in the pricing stages, and based on where the stock is traded in the home market this morning, uh, significantly above where the stock was priced by Morgan Stanley, we've gone to a, what we call an order imbalance based on parity in the home market. It's more than 10% uh, above the pricing uh, of Morgan Stanley. It's 41 and 6, which it was priced at. The stock is looking around 48 on 175,000 shares right now. India's informational services industry earned um, revenue of 5.7 U.S. dollars um, for fiscal year 99-2000. Uh, we'll hear a little bit more about this from Dewan Mehta, president of the National Association of Software and Services Company. Um, Mr. Mehta, what, is, what does Vipro's listing mean for the Indian technology sector as a whole? I would say a lot because Vipro is the most valuable Indian company uh, we have in the country. It's in the terms of revenue the second largest software exporter from the country. And we are very excited that Wipro is listed on New York Stock Exchange. This is the sixth Indian IT company to be listed on American Stock Exchange. And we believe that in the next 15 months, 15 more Indian technology companies would be list on American Stock Exchange. It's, it's very exciting. What does the NASCAR McKinsey report project for India's information technology industry? Well, we, uh, 99 2000 fiscal, our industry was $5.7 billion, and we believe as per NASCOM McKenzie report, by 2008 we should be doing $87 billion of annual revenue, $50 billion going for exports. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you. We're back here live on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. We're going to talk with Greg Krowitz right now from Client Services, who can tell us exactly what's happening with Vipro's stock. Well, we just checked with the specialist, and the stock was re-indicated at a range of 44 to 47. And what we hear right now is that the stock is looking at a price of about 44 and a half on 470,000 shares. And it looks like we could be opening in about a minute. Oh, we're about to open the stock. Let's see. The stock just opened at 44 and a half. And how many shares? 470,000. On 470,000 ADR volume. No problem. No problem. Yeah, we should bring up. Very few moving up there. Moving up. dollars from opening excuse me it's up three dollars from the pricing so the market is very strong on technologies this morning and that has benefited with now this is the boss okay let's talk to the boss now mr premji how exciting is this for you to be here today oh it's very very exciting and it's quite an event how did it feel to ring the bell this morning a lot of fun i thought there was fun to it and there was very much seriousness to it Something I've Very always wanted event. to do. Yes, it is. What does what does this really mean for Vipro? 
It means for Wipro now, we have been India's leading market cap company for over a year now. This means that we are part of a global scene and we've got the legitimacy of a global scene now by listing on a leading global market. What does it mean for the future of Vipro's um, global informational technology services? I think it gives us a clear transparency with a lot of customers and a clear transparency with a lot of prospective customers will be expanding our base too because they'll have much more visibility with them vis vis our financial results and our track record. Thank you very much. Thank We're going to talk to Richard Grotto right now, the chairman of yeah. the New York Stock Exchange. Thank you so much. How exciting is this um, for Vipro as far as international listings are concerned? Well, of course, Wipro is the largest market cap company in India. It's a global leader in information technology. And so for the New York Stock Exchange, it's a very special moment in our history. I want to welcome all of the employees of Wipro from around the world. It is a true landmark transaction in the history of both the great company Wipro and in the history of the New York Stock Exchange. Well, congratulations to all of the wonderful employees of Wipro. It is a very special honor to welcome you to our family. My dear Wiproites, a few moments ago, we listed Wipro in the New York Stock Exchange. We articulated a global vision of being in the top 10 companies about two and a half months back. This event marks the beginning of our journey to leadership in the global financial world. I'm terribly excited about it. I congratulate each and every one of you for making this happen. We have come a long way from where we began more than 50 years ago as a small manufacturing unit in a small town in Maharashtra. Though we were small, we had big dreams. We resolved to become a leader in the emerging and growing businesses we identified. We are today the largest IT company and the largest marketized cap company in India. We have a powerful brand name in India. Our ability to attain leadership has resulted in becoming Wip, making Wipro the most valuable company in India. We are now on the threshold of something bigger. India is in the forefront of the knowledge resolution, revolution that is dominating the world. We are, as leader from India, are in poise for global leadership. Listing in New York Stock Exchange is a major step towards achieving this vision of global leadership. What does the leadership on New York Stock Exchange offer us? NYSE listing today offers us three significant benefits. First and foremost, build Wipro as a global brand with our customers and our prospective customers. The listing is an accelerator to build the Wipro brand on the global platform. NYSE is a home to a majority of global Fortune 100 corporations. It places us on the same platform as the global corporations. Our performance will now be on a global platform and will get us the recognition for our performance globally. Secondly, it will help us to build recognition with our global customer base and potential partners who will have in their, us in their line of vision all the time because of the New York Stock Exchange. Third, it will provide us a currency to attract employees from different countries and background as you become more multicultural and as we add to our field force and our technical force. All this translates to growth and prosperity for all connected with Wipro. To you individually, the growth will create enormous opportunities for professional growth, challenge, and wealth creation. The tremendous opportunities we have come with an equally challenging performance benchmark. Our benchmarks now change from being the best in India to the best in the world, and that is very important. We have to be better than the best to achieve our global vision. We have formulated a global vision that was communicated more than two months back in August. I am more than confident that we can achieve our vision of being the top 10 global IT services company in the world. This will not happen on its own. We have the base to make this happen, but we need to work smart and we need to work hard to realize this vision. Wipro has some of the best talent in the world. Our customers have repeatedly acknowledged this. We have the best quality processes in place. Global benchmarks of SEI and Six Sigma initiatives have confirmed this. Our customers have confirmed this. 
We were the first software company in the world to achieve SEI 5, which is the equivalent of the Nobel Prize of Software. We have the vision, the talent, and the quality processes to achieve global leadership. What we need is to translate the vision into reality. To achieve this, let us rededicate ourselves to the promise with utmost respect to human values. We promise to serve our customers with integrity through a variety of innovative, value for money products and services by applying thought day after day. I once again thank all of you for making this happen and look forward to the future with optimism. Thank you very much.